Hello guys on the prize, how is it going? Welcome to another video. In today's video we're doing an anime discussion, review, or whatever you want to call it, on the bottom tier character, uh, Tomozaki-kun. Tomozaki-kun, I always, his name is always the one thing I mess up, but hey, we're doing it today, Tomozaki-kun. I just finished the anime yesterday, I just caught up on everything, because I was behind on most anime actually. <laughs> so I was, I'm, I'm catching up on anime, and so I finally went in and decided to go and finish Tomozaki-kun. I'm starting to call it that because it's easier for me. Um, but anyways, yeah, it's just so cool seeing this man grow into a... Into a normie? <laughs> is, that, is that what we're going with here? <laughs> I think so. I think it's a normie. I don't, I don't know what to tell you. But it, man, this guy's going normie levels. He's playing the game called Life. But with that said, let's just get into the plot of this story so I can continue rambling on about how much I like the story. So with that said, let's go. So the plot begins with Tomozaki-kun, a number one player in this game called TacFam, which is basically this game's world of Smash Bros. Like, the game is basically Smash Bros. Like, it's not even trying to hide it. <laughs> no, it's totally Smash Bros. And yeah, he's number one, and his rival is No Name. And her real name personality, and she also happens to go to his school. You know, No Name, out of everywhere you can find online, No Name is at his school. And she is a girl. And she is really popular with everybody. And her name is Hinami. Aoi Hinami, I'm pretty sure that's what her name is. But anyways, since No Name loses, or Aoi loses to this man, uh, to Mozaki kun a lot. Like, I mean, a lot. Like, she's never won against him at least at all in their, like, long time, like, rivalry on Tag Fam. So, she gets a little annoyed. And it's like, hey... Wanna meet up? Wanna be? Wanna, I wanna see what you're like in person. And then when they meet, uh, well, she's a little disappointed because this man, who is her ideal, per, like tech fan player rival, is actually a loser, a, a bottom tier character, if you will. And so she's like, okay, we can't, we can't be having this. We can't be having this. I don't want to train you. And she's also surprised at the fact that she knows who Tomozaki Kun is because she's in her class or in her in her school. At the very least. So he, she, she's like, okay, alright. You know, you, you want to try this game at life? Because she loves life. She thinks life is a god tier game. And Tomozaki Kun is like, nah, fam, I f fuck life. Tech fam is, is life. <laughs> He's like, nah, fam, nah, nah. Life is a garbage game. So they kind of argue and bicker for a bit. And then Tomozaki Kun's like, hey. Or no, Hinami's like, hey, you should actually try the game called Life and I'll help you out. I'll give you daily tasks. Like, for one, I talk to people, smile more, put more effort in your appearance. You know, all this different stuff. Leveling up, so to speak, and gaining friends and actually trying at this game called Life. And it's it's so fun to see. And yeah, that's yeah, basically what we get to. That's our general plot. You know, it's just, that's the setup. You know, we're getting this bottom tier character and leveling him up too. Well, mid mid tier. Although apparently this man is rocking. He has he's rocking something, man. He's rocking. <laughs> he's rocking a forearm, if you know what I'm saying. But <laughs> if you watch the anime, you'll get the joke. But anyways, it's so good. Uh, I like the opening song too. Honestly, I like how it how how it is. Like the bullet haired chick, you know, with all the all always friends, like him getting to know them, and everything in the story. Even his like bully, it's not really a bully. It's more of like a like a, a popular boy in the in his class. Also challenges him to like an attack fan match, and it's honestly really cool. I like to see like Tomozaki just get better and actually give it a shot, which is weird coming from me because I, I I can no <laughs> no. It's really fun seeing this him level up and it's also cool seeing him break out of like realize you don't need a mask like honestly like in this whole anime built up to wearing a mask and in the end like it's kind of a spoiler but he realized uh he doesn't need a mask and and he doesn't need to because he realized when he's talking to to this girl I'll put her name on the screen because i don't remember it's the white haired chick he doesn't need to wear a mask like she finds it easier to talk to him when he's not Reusing pre-made conversation topics and memorizing everything in like conversations and like, keep the conversation flowing She likes him better as himself 
and he finally realizes that after like, a fireworks show. So seeing him grow and and honestly seeing the flaws with Almin or uh, Almin, I was I was looking I was watching Code Code earlier. Uh, Alwi's like me mentality, seeing that she has her flaws there, and she loves the mask. She won't drop it, and he's like, okay, the mask isn't the way to go. And I, I'm liking this, I'm liking this, and seeing how he progresses through the story from being awkward to a little less awkward is just fun. So if you like your good rom-com stuff, then you're going to like this anime. I don't know what to talk about next, it's really just, there's like a like a school president little arc where, where Tomozaki helps one of her friends and trying to become the school president. And he fails, and then she's like, okay, I, I she has a few inferiority complex, all that stuff and stuff, but yeah, it's only, only really... Oh, I talked about what I wanted to talk about in the story, so I'm just gonna say this is the wrap up. If you like rom com anime, and if you if you kind of like Snafu, oddly enough, if if it's not like a it's not deep like that deep at all, but it kind of reminds me like a, of a dim down Snafu or Origaru. So you know, if you like if you like that story, you might you might like this. You know, you might like this story. So honestly. Go give it a shot, as I, I really like this story, and I wasn't gonna watch it in in the beginning, but I did. So yeah, go, go give it a shot. If you like your rom coms, if you like Oigaru, and all, all different stuff, then go give it a shot. But with that said, that's all I have to say for this video. Hopefully, this gave you some enlightenment to the story, and how it gets kind of deeper with the use of masks and the use of like personas when you like faking yourself. Like in front of other people and realizing you don't have to use that mask. It just brings up a lot of kind of deeper topics. That's kind of a deep topic. And it's kind of cringy, I'm not gonna lie, but uh, at moments. But it's also really funny and it's also really cool to see Tomozaki grow. And that's really why I like to watch it. So, with that said, if you do this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more because I'll be bringing more. And we're back from our break from coronavirus, obviously. And yeah, so with that said, I'll see you guys all next time. Johnny!